off up to that moment. Um, yeah, I mean, it was all about you're, you're trying to win the game. Uh, we're going according to our, our work, our, our matchups, etc. cetera. Um, I did want to give him today off, um, primarily because of the left-handed pitcher, too. Chen would not have been a good matchup for him. So he sits around, he rests. He's come almost like his first at-bat in a night game, and he comes up and makes a home run. It's fantastic. Um, and we, we could talk all about that, but I want to say this. Ben Zobris playing left field today won tonight's game, or to this, whatever this was. It's like a brunch game. Um, Zoe's defense won today's game, period. Um, the play off the wall uh, with Weeders, the throw to the plate. How many times do you play left field this year, Arby? Second time. There Second start. That tells you something about the guy. Molina's block as well. Oh, that, not only the block, but the, just to catch that ball was incredible uh, from the angle. I've been, you know, I did catch, so you know how tough that play is. Even just to catch it and then have the ability to do what he did, that play was spectacular. The way you used your bullpen was absolutely brilliant. What do you make of how you game plan and also their contribution to the South Pole games? Well, there's no, there's no Rodney, so you gotta, you gotta work from the back, back towards the middle of the game, and so, you know, Joel and Jake were gonna, and and uh, Jamie gonna be the latter part of the game. Uh, in the middle there, I mean, every at bat counts. I mean, going back and forth with Gomes and Wesley, etc., and Alex to get through that middle. Even you know, if they get another run or two right there, that could have made a huge difference in the game. Of course you would not do that in June or July, of course not, but with the extra players, extra pitchers, uh, every at bat, every out, every pitch count, so we had to do it, and they all came through. I mean, Wesley walked in, but Wesley's been fantastic, uh, but overall the bullpen has been uh, stellar. Four games straight, this team has not lost offensive confidence. How do you speak to this gritty comeback mentality? Well, you know, you can feel it. I mean, we're getting to that point where we can feel it in the dugout. Um, Meaning uh, the game started out, uh, we did okay, and then all of a sudden they took the lead. And they were, uh, Baltimore was doing pretty well, but you could still feel it within the group that we believe. And I, it's it's one of those intangible thoughts or whatever. It's just that it's there. It's 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 palpable. You can feel it. You know, it's, you can't necessarily describe it in regards to form, but it's there. And you can you know, you know your guys have that uh, vibe going on. That's a good feeling. Uh, today we played uh, back in the second base. We had. Uh, Will Myers in right field, and we had Archie starting the game. That's pretty cool stuff out there winning. Joe, you said earlier in the season, even during its hardships, that this bullpen would eventually become the best in the majors. Do you think this is the best bullpen you've ever had? Well, um, it's it's among the best. Um, you know, last year they were really firm last year also. And I think back of you when Benny was here, Ben Juan Soriano and that group, that was also really good. I'd say, you know, I think we've had good bullpens. Our first couple years we did not. <laughs> They kind of struggled with the latter part of the game. I think since we've gotten better, the bullpens have been on an annual basis pretty good. Is 